Well, with all the talk of nuclear war going on at the moment, I thought I would share five facts of what could happen if there was a nuclear attack, in particular on the state of Texas. Now, fact number one, this is more of at a national level, but in the event of a nuclear attack, potential targets in the United States would include large population centers, military installations, and critical infrastructure. Some examples of likely U.S. nuclear targets include the Pentagon, obviously, Camp David, Jim Creek Naval Radio Station in Washington, Fort Ritchie in Maryland, and McLennan Air Force Base in California. But fact number two, Texas is home to several military installations, including Fort Hood, Joint Base San Antonio, and the Red River Army Depot. And these could potentially be targets in the event of a nuclear attack. Fact number three, Texas has several nuclear power plants, such as the South Texas Nuclear Generating Station and the Comanche Peak Nuclear Power Plant. However, and unfortunately, the same technology and personnel may, uh, may not always be available to maintain the plants. And there's no telling what could happen if they are not properly maintained after such an attack. Fact number four, during the arms race, many Texans feared nuclear annihilation and grappled with the need to build bomb shelters in their backyards. And while there is no definitive answer to which city in Texas is most likely to be hit by a nuclear attack, first off, and actually close to Texas, but not right in Texas, is the Los Alamos National Laboratory. That's in New Mexico, but it's not too far away, which is the primary location for nuclear bomb design in the United States. That's obviously a big target. Additionally, a 1990 FEMA nuclear target map for Texas suggests that several cities, including Houston, San Antonio, and Austin could be potential targets. And however, it's essential to note that the map is conceptual. It doesn't mean that every site will be hit in an all-out nuclear war. Ultimately, though, it is impossible to predict with certainty which city in Texas or anywhere else would be most likely to be hit by a nuclear attack, but it's crucial to be aware of the potential consequences of such an event and take appropriate safety measures. But in general, fact number five, in the event of a nuclear war or attack, Texas would likely be a target due to its large population and important military installations. Obviously, again, it's important to have a plan in place and know what to do in case of a nuclear emergency. So I just thought I'd share some quick facts about Texas and about the threat of nuclear war and what would happen in our state, especially that's where I'm at right now. We'll keep you updated, though. What are your thoughts? Leave them in the comments below. Do you like our facts-based uh, video? If you're interested in this type of reporting along with our normal reporting, let me know in the comments below. And, of course, as usual, share our reports. TNS Texas News Studio, Mark Myers. We'll talk to you soon at the next report.